Welcome back to another Move Monday. My name is Coach Travis, and October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And there's still time to register for the Breast Cancer Walk, which will be held this Saturday, October 14th at Soldier Field. This is a great way to support and raise awareness for an important cause while connecting with your CTA family and friends. This will be a fun and social event, and there's still time to sign up. So team, the event site opens up at 8 a.m. and the walk will officially kick off around 10 a.m. But before we hit the pavement, I want to show you a quick warm up for your joints and for your muscles that's going to help prevent injuries and improve your performance. Here are four mobility exercises that you can do before and after our long walk. All right, team. So the first move I want to show you is called a single leg hip rotation. So we're going to start off with our feet flat and our feet about hip width apart. You're going to place your hands on your hips and we're going to start off with our left leg. So we're going to drive that left knee in about waist level. And then I want you to externally rotate into a circular uh, motion. And that's perfect. So again, I want you to move like this for about 10 to 20 seconds. Again, opening up the knee, circling the back to that neutral position, balancing on that opposite leg, continuing to breathe as you move. Perfect. And I want you to continue to move for about 10 to 20 seconds. And if, you have, if you're having trouble with balance, it's totally fine to hold on to something for support. And then just relax and then repeat on the opposite side. This is a great mobility exercise that will improve your hip and knee mobility along with your hamstring flexibility. This will also strengthen your ankles by incorporating balance in that opposite leg. So the second stretch I wanna show you is called a side lunge stretch. So I want you to open up your stance to wherever you're comfortable, but we wanna open up that stance a little bit. Feel free to place your hands on your hips. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna push your hips back, the knees can stay slightly bent, but we're gonna shift your weight to one side. I'm shifting my weight to the right. I'm bending my right knee. Again, I'm pushing my hips back, keeping that opposite leg straight, leaning back, leaning forward just slightly, and then just take a deep breath. You're gonna feel the stretch in the inner thighs, but then as we breathe, I want us to come back to that middle position, and then we're gonna shift to the opposite side. So I want you to move for about 20 to 30 seconds, shifting from side to side, pushing the hips back, and continuing to breathe as you move. You got it. This movement will assist with hip and ankle mobility while stretching the hip flexors, those adductors, and glutes. So the next stretch I wanna show you is called the standing knee to chest stretch. So I want you to start off in a nice comfortable position. And we're gonna alternate hugging our knees, bringing our knees in towards our chest. And with that opposite foot, try to keep that opposite foot planted to the ground while you alternate bringing your knees in towards your chest. You wanna to try to stay nice and tall throughout this movement. Continuing to breathe as you hug, hug those knees. You're landing nice and soft, and I want you to try to move for about 20 to 30 seconds. And also, move at your own pace. Perfect. This is a great movement that's gonna improve your hip and knee mobility, while increasing the flexibility in your glutes and your hamstrings. The next exercise I wanna show you is called a hamstring and calf sweep. So I want you to start off in the split stance position. So I have my right leg back and then my left leg is forward. I'm gonna lift my left toe, pressing my left heel into the ground. With my arms to the side, I'm gonna reach towards my ankles and I'm gonna sweep my arms up and flow back into this neutral position. So again, push the hips back, reach towards those ankles, sweep those arms up, let those arms fall, and then continue to repeat for about 15 to 20 seconds. And then repeat on the opposite side of your leg. 
Perfect. So this is a great exercise that will improve your knee and ankle mobility while stretching out your hamstrings, your lower back, and your calf muscles. All right, team. So I have a couple quick announcements and reminders for you. We have our breast cancer walk coming up at Soldier Field, October 14th, kicking off at 10 a.m. We also have many other fall races coming up. So check out our wellness boards or visit our website to register. We also have our well-informed seminar, October 24th at 11 a.m. titled Domestic Violence Awareness. So please check out our wellness boards or visit our website for more information. And then we have our Financial Fridays, Debt Management Seminars. It will be conducted every Friday of the month in October at 12 p.m. with David Fowler from Empower. So feel free to check out a session or two. And then as a reminder for those who have Sigma Insurance and participating in our Motivate Me program, the deadline is October 31st. So make sure you complete your doctor's appointments and report those self-reported activities to receive cash back on your paycheck. Thank you so much for your time today. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more great content. And I'm looking forward to seeing you all next week on another Move Monday. Take care, team.